Afghanistan Smash 7 sixes in a row against Zimbabwe in T20 Afghanistan smashed seven sixes off seven deliveries against Zimbabwe in the second match of the T20I Tri-Series. Afghanistan all-rounder Mohamed Nabi dispatched fast bowler Tendai Chatara's last four deliveries for maximums in the 17th over, while Naji Bullah's Adran followed it by slamming three sixes on the first three delivers of the 18th. Overbowled by fast bowler Neville Nadiva. Steve Smith literally cannot get out. It's weird. Jofra Archer talking about Australia batsman Steve Smith, who set a world record by scoring his 10th straight 50-plus score against England. Pacer Jofra Archer said, It's weird. Every time he bats, he just, I don't know what it is. He literally cannot get out, especially if he plays a bad shot. The ball just lands in no man's land, he added. Days after retirement U-turn. Ryudu named captain of Hyderabad days after his decision to come out of retirement from all forms of cricket. Ambati Ryudu was on Saturday appointed captain of Hyderabad for the upcoming Vijay Hazare Trophy. Hyderabad will kick off their season against Karnataka on September 24. Ryudu had announced his retirement after not being selected in India's World Cup squad. Johnny Bairstow fakes collecting the ball. Forces Steve Smith to dive during the fourth delivery in 30th over of Australia's first innings in. Fifth Ashes Test. England wicketkeeper Johnny Bairstow faked collecting the throw to run Steve Smith out. Bairstow's action forced Smith to dive to his crease. Following this, Bairstow smiled for pulling off the trick. Five penalty runs as per the laws of the game, Jason Gillespie tweeted. Lesson for me. Coley on his pick that sparked Dhoni's retirement room as Virat Kohli has clarified the reason behind him posting a throwback picture that sparked MS Dhoni's retirement rumors. I didn't have anything on my mind. I was just sitting at my home and uploaded the picture. It became news. It's a lesson for me that what I think about myself the world doesn't necessarily see it that way, he said.